the digital age of consent is probably one of the more famous changes to data protection law brought about by the GDPR. It states that where data is collected from a child on the basis of consent in order to offer an online service to them, then that consent is only valid for children below a certain age where it is provided by the holder of parental responsibility. In other words, the child's parent or guardian. In Ireland, the age of digital consent has been set at 16, meaning that for all children under this age, online service providers, such as social media platforms and other online platforms, must obtain the consent of the child's parent or guardian in order to provide that service, where the basis of the processing is consent. Now that last part is very important because there is a misconception around the age of digital consent that it means that internet companies cannot process the data of children below a certain age unless they have the consent of, that, of the child's parent in any circumstances. But that's not necessarily true because consent is actually just one of the six lawful bases open to companies under Article 6 of the GDPR. And this is why, in case you've ever wondered, why social media platforms have sign-up ages of significantly lower than the digital age of consent in Ireland. It's because one thing has nothing to do with the other. Now, all of this illustrates that the age of digital consent is a data protection measure and not an online safety measure. In other words, it's not designed to be a cutoff age below which children are shut out of certain parts of the internet, but rather it is the age at which children can begin to give their own consent to the sharing of their personal data without parental involvement. All of this to say, don't assume that an online service is processing your data on the basis of consent, because they may be relying on an alternate legal basis that is open to them under the GDPR. Make sure that you read the privacy policies of the social media sites and services that you use so that you have a full understanding of the legal bases that are being availed of and your rights in relation to your data as a result. Mm -hmm.